Hi everyone, how you guys are doing? I hope everybody is good today. We'll do the reading for the September 5th, okay? And will be for the earth signs, for the fire signs, for the water signs, and for the air signs, okay? Keep in mind, it's just a general reading and will not resonate with everybody, okay? Also, if you like this video, please like, subscribe, or share, or comment. And if you want something specific for you, for your situation, some guidance, or some something what you want to know about the person you're really interested, you'll please look down below for my information. And any mail I get, I get as soon as possible. I'm saying it. Okay. Also, if it is not resonating in the few minutes from you see this, please do not match it with your situation because I don't pick everybody's energy. It will be just for a specific few, okay? Keep in mind that. And also keep in mind it's just a general reading. Okay. And we'll do for everybody, as usual we do, 10 cards, okay? For the 5th or September, okay. Earth signs, fire signs. Water signs. And air signs. Okay, and let's pick up a chord from the Dorian Virtue for each one. Okay, whatever it's picking up, I always pick what the card said. I never sugarcoat my readings, not the general readings, not the personal readings. I always pick the truth, the way my cards give in to me, the way I deliver them, okay? I never give the outcome, which you might be surprised sometimes, but that is really the truth, and my card's never lying to me, okay? Earth science, fire science, water science, and air science. Okay. And let's see what the card says about each one of you, okay? All right, earth signs. Hmm, okay. Sometimes I'll keep the silence just because I gather the information from the universe and from my spirit guides. But the message, it's coming very clear. Okay, at this point in your life, for this period of time, a day or two, what I'm feeling here, you're juggling two people, two jobs, or money, and what I'm feeling here, you're working a lot. What I'm dealing here, what we are seeing here, it's an, a person who's working a lot, okay? But a person with a lot of passion. And they want to go towards somebody who is also passionate. Could be a Sagittarius because we have, could be an earth sign towards Virgo and Capricorns. Could be... And a fire sign, not only Sagittarius, but this is the card of Sagittarius. Could be a fire sign, could be a Sagittarius, Leo, or Aries. Okay, so you're moving with an effort towards them because you want a commitment on them and you reflected on that. But the person you are dealing, they are very conflicted. Could be the mother of your child, okay? And you're moving passionately towards them and you are willing to work with them even in the past you were sneaky or they were a little sneaky towards you okay because I always call the five of swords is the loser card you're battling with yourself not with for a good reason and could be some some people involved in this situation and that's why the person it's a little guarded it's a little conflicted towards you but you are going to tell them I don't want to juggle anymore could be a third party, could not be, okay? But what I'm feeling here, you are between either two things, two people, okay? 
but you now are willing to put into work. Could be a Taurus, okay? Could be a Cancerian. But what I'm feeling here, you moving towards them after you reflect of this and you want to offer them commitment. It is not much, but the Knight of uh, Cups that show me you will offer them emotions. And could be a situation in which you've been in and out of your life or they've been in and out of your life. But what I'm feeling here, this is the Queen of Pentacles. It's a motherly, it's a fatherly um, energy what is giving to me. So keep in mind, will be a couple fights in here, some arguments in here. Because you really want this and they could not really be at the same page with you. But you're moving towards them. You're moving towards commitment because you want commitment with them. And you telling them, I'm, I'm willing to put into work this. And I don't want to juggle anymore. Because it's too much for me. Okay, Earth signs? And yes, you're going to, towards your soulmate. I don't think... I think this is the third day it's coming to soul me for you. You are really into your mind about this person. Could be a Taurus, could be a fire sign, could be a, a, a the same um, Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn, or they could have uh, Earth in their chart. Okay, but this is for sure you. You want commitment for them. And could be in and out of your relation, in, in, in and out of your life. But what I'm feeling here, you strongly work. Probably you're a little short with money, but you really want this person because you feel this is your person and you want to commit to them. Or they want to come because the energy can come vice versa, okay? All right, Earth signs, that's for you for the 5th of September. Let's see what's the fire signs, which is Sagis, Aries, and Leos. What's going on? Hmm... Okay. Are you waiting for something to move on? Are you waiting for Virgo, which you've been heartbroken, but you still love this person, what I'm feeling here? Okay. The situation is involved. It's involving a child in here, what I'm feeling here. Or kids, okay. But you feel this person is lying to you, even if you're waiting for them to take a new start again you feel backstabbed and you feel very betrayed you feel very left out in the cold strongly dealing with the Virgo or with the Gemini okay could be an earth science could be a Scorpio but what I'm feeling here you just want to walk away okay because pages that's immature energy is like uh, I'm feeling I'm dealing with a child in here or you guys can have child, uh, kids even if it's a lot of love you feel very betrayed by them you very feel heartbroken but you had your insights deep inside you you know this person will leave you out in the cold again and again and again so now you even if you wait for them to move on with them you will decide to move on from this person why or they could move on from you because it's not a fair share and will be a lot of secrecy in here and you feel very very left out in the cold very very depressed what i'm feeling here and you feel very betrayed and even if you reflect on that deep, deep inside, you waited for them for so long to take a new, a new start. It is not coming. And they will talk to you about this. Even, even it is still love in this situation. One of you is moving on from this situation. Could be you, the fire sign. But yes, this is your person. You would deal with your soulmate, with your twin flame, because this is a commitment relationship, commi committed relationship, but being a break, because this person or you has something hidden, could be a hidden person, could be some secrets, and they're not telling you the truth, and you waited for them to come the truth, but it's not. So now you feel like, uh, I think I gotta move on because you are not really speaking the truth. Even you feel this person, yes, is your person, but it is not going nowhere. And you feel like, um, 
I don't think so. Okay. Oh, okay. Fire sign. Let's see the water sign and what they are doing here. Okay, you're very conflicted, which you, and you want to move on from a situation for sure. Could be a third party and got very toxic. You want your fair share, you want your new beginning, and you're still reflecting on that. But what I'm feeling here, you deal with somebody who is in a third party, which they come in fast and they will tell you about that. And they give their fair share to somebody else. Could be involved a fire sign, uh, Aries, Leo, or Sagittarius, could be a Capricorn, could be an earth sign, highly. Okay, but. What I'm feeling here, you want your four of wands. You want your passion. You want your passion back. You want your home back. You want something new, and you are reflecting now. They are coming towards you, and they are coming very fast. Okay, but they will speak about this third party to you. They will tell you about that, and it will be a a conversation which you don't like it. And what I'm feeling here, mm, you will not really like it and you feel like, mm, I want my new beginning, okay? This person you're dealing, or you've been your third party, or the person you're dealing, and you, both of you, you are talking like very conflicted talk, very like you are not at the same page. Even you got so much work into this, you're still reflecting towards this, toward this betrayal you've been, and you just want to move on. Because 3-3, three, three, that shows me it's not going anywhere. And yes, let go of control issues. Allow the situation to unfold naturally. Okay? Reflect on this. Reflect on this because... What I'm feeling here, yes, you want to move towards your happy home. You want to move to a happy moment, to a, a happier life. And yes, what I'm feeling here now, you're moving away. You could move towards somebody who will give you this fulfillment. Okay? And what you feel like what was in the past is not serving you anymore. And that's how you will speak. You will speak the, the truth. I don't want to be in this situation anymore because it got very, very toxic. All right, fi uh, water signs for the 5th of September. Let's see the air sign, what's going on. Ooh, okay. All right. Something will blow your mind and could deal with somebody you really love. Somebody you really love they will come to you and will speak. Could be a Leo, could be a water sign, could be an earth sign. But this person who's coming towards you will very surprise you. And you are looking at them for some time, okay? For at least nine weeks, nine months. And yes, it is a lot of love. Or you could give them your cup of love. You could give them something which is coming very slow because the Knight of Pentacles is the slowest night. Some, something very, very, like, stable. And what I'm feeling in the past, this person refused you. Probably was money issues or you hold back towards them. But now you, you guys will start kind of a communication. You'll speak the truth. You could deal with the mother of your child, which you love this person a lot, or this person loves you a lot, and they want a new beginning, some sort of new beginning, just because the kids are involved here. But at the same time, they, they don't tell you everything. Even Queen of Swords and the High Priestess, they are the opposites, okay? But it is love, and whatever they're coming, you are very hesitant to take it. You are very guarded. You are very like holding back kind of. But what I'm feeling here will be a happy outcome because deep inside you know they still love you and it is a lot of love, okay? 
because we have the soulmate card and you could deal with this person for a long time could be here for the other lifetime and even was like holding back like talk about it even though they will not tell you all what you want to hear all what you want to need to know about that they they now they are coming with the truth but they are very hesitant to tell you that but will be a talk because the sun is the happiest card in our deck and what I'm feeling here it's a lot of love could be like that childish love but anyway they will speak the truth because they know now who they love or you will speak the truth now who you love because this is you okay air sign could be a Libra involved here could be a water sign could be an earth sign okay that's what what I'm picking up could be a Leo okay and you feel like you are so codependent addiction are affecting your romantic life okay you are like so tied to this person that you could not even believe it okay also could be you are dealing with some issues and the person was not okay even if it's still love and they will tell you about this you want to be with us finish those uh, addictions okay you wanna move on with us you wanna have a happy home finish with that crap you're doing okay that that will tell you and will blow your mind because you didn't even expect this coming towards you or they didn't expect you coming towards them say like hey now I'm clean I wanna make it right okay but you dealing with some some addictions what I'm feeling here somebody okay all right my lovelies this is your reading for September 5th of 2018 thank you very much please like subscribe or share or comment and if you want a specific reading a personal reading for you just for your situation don't hesitate to contact me thank you very much namaste